Monique Morrow from Dr. Mara and Mental Class, and I am doing uh, modeling and propagation of an axon down a neuron. And this is my project. So, before we start off, I'm going to show you the two systems that we use to perform action potential. This is your brain, and we have the central nervous system, which consists of the brain and the spinal cord. And then we have a peripheral nervous system. This um, consists of the nerves leading to the CNS. So this is a neuron. Um, I will be showing how the propagation of an um, axon goes down a neuron. Um, so this is a picture of a neuron. This is an axon, the nose around the air. Um, this is your cell body. I'm going to be showing the action potential going down this in uh, my next step. So before I show you the uh, propagation of an axon down a neuron, I'm going to show you what happens for that to get to that. So the first thing that happens is that you pass the threshold, so then your sodium channels open up and sodium rushes into the cell. Once it hits up to minus 30, the sodium uh, channel closes and your um, potassium channel opens. The depolarization of the cell to go back into its resting potential by the potassium going out of the cell. So this is a neuron showing action potential. I'm going to show you how um, the propagation of an axon goes down a neuron and I'm going to go deep into how everything works. So this yellow foam is showing an axon and this axon is a fiber that extends from the terminal to the cell body and this is how signals are transmitted. So then we go to our nose renvier, which is this black string in the middle. These are the um, gaps that are in between the segments. Um, the plastic wrap you see on top of the foam is the myelin sheath. So myelin sheaths are pro protein and phospholipids forming the um, widest sheath around the nerve fibers. And these um, increase the speed and impulses that are conducted. So the more there are, the faster the nerve signal will go through. So to finish off this action potential, we have three conductions to talk about. We have your saltatory conduction, your continuous conduction, and the conduction velocity. So a saltatory conduction is just a jump from node to node to node down an axon. And this is just a faster way of a signal to travel down an axon. We have the continuous conduction. This is the wave of depolarization that travels down the length of an axon. And the conduction velocity is the speed in which the, uh, electro, the electrical impulse can be transmitted. So all that, including the axon, the myelin sheath, the nose around the air, the CNS, the PNS, and all that fancy stuff is how uh, propagation of an axon is modeled down in